He can currently be seen in the Glass Menagerie and is a fellow Los Angeles High School of the Arts alum. Go Loxa! Uh, we have no chant, we are arts kids, but maybe I just started one. And she is starring in The Marvelous Miss Maisel on Amazon. They're both Emmy Award nominated actors who starred together in last year's Othello. Ladies and gentlemen, Finn Whitrock and Rachel Brosnahan. This side, yeah. Thanks. It's all yours. Hi. Uh, we had a great time doing Othello at New York Theatre Workshop together. Yes, we did. Yeah. Our, uh, our cast really bonded. We did. We bonded, which I find is often the case with uh, shows starring James Bond. <gasps> yeah. I knew I recognized him from somewhere. Yeah. He's got one of those faces. Oh, yeah, he does. But in all seriousness, our cast was very close, and we're very happy that Matthew Mayer was recognized tonight. Yeah. Matthew. Matthew Mayer, who was in the show. Uh, I, I, I only hung out with the leads. Yeah. <laughs> Typical, yeah. The nominees for the 2017 <laughs> Lucille Hotel Award for Outstanding Lead Actor in a Play are... Reed Burney, Man from Nebraska. Michael Emerson, Wakey Wakey. Lucas Hedges, Yen. Joe Morton, Turn Me Loose. David Hyde Pierce, A Life. And the recipient of the 2017 Lucille Lortel Award for Lead Actor in a Play goes to... Joe, Joe Morton. Morton, Turn Me Loose. <laughs> My goodness. Well, um, first of all, I'd like to thank the Off-Broadway League and Lucille Lortel. I'd love to thank John Gould Rubin, who directed Turn Me Loose, uh, Gretchen Law, who wrote Turn Me Loose, and the producers Jackie Judd and Beth Hubbard and Eric Falkenberg and John Legend, um, and also my lead scene nut. Uh, but mostly, I would like to thank Dick Gregory. For living the life that he did and doing the deeds that he did and telling the truth that he did. As many people have sort of talked about this evening, this is a time for us to sort of be very vigilant in terms of what we say and how we say it and what we do. And I think that his voice uh, is an echo from the past to the present and if he were himself then, now, he might say something to the effect of, um, you know, they got you believing that revolution is black against white, Christians against Muslims, Jews against Palestinians, liberals against conservatives, as long as they got you fighting against your neighbor, the rich man's gonna rob you blind. <laughs> You see, if you accept injustice, then you become injustice. If you coexist with filth, then you become filth. Uh-huh. Thank you. <laughs> 